What is up, everybody? It's Miss Strange here. Today we are back once again on Subnautica. Yay! So today we are going to be building the prawn soup, which means we have to find all the essential pieces. Which means I had to find the gel sacks. Now I've been looking everywhere for these gel sacks, and right in front of you, right is right right here in front of you is a gel sack. Oh, I forgot to power that. There, now we got power. But this is the reason I've been having issues because without the gel sack I've been unable to get um, everything needed to build the sea moss uh, the prawn soup. There it is. So I need arrow gel which is... Well I'm sure I'll be able to build after I pick this up. I don't really remember how many I need. I think I need at least two. But hopefully I can maybe grow some more of this. I'm not entirely sure. They aren't that big. They have Oh my god, it has five food and five health. I wonder if I can, like, break it. I can. Okay. So all you gotta do is use a knife on it, you can grow more. And I just broke my only knife. Go figure. But we don't need a knife for this one. Um, we actually just need the rest of the materials, which I should now be able to do. So I will be right back inside my, uh, prime, uh, not my prime, my cyclops. Can't remember the name of anything today. And we're going to have a little bit of fun. I need to make arrow gel, which is, I believe, right here. Okay, so I need aluminum oxide crystals. Now, fortunately for me, I actually already got those. But if anyone is looking for aluminum oxide crystals, uh, just go directly underneath of the um, floating island. And that is one of the best places to get them. But I believe I have some in one of these things. Wherever I put it. There it is. Lunar Moxide Crystal. And I believe that is the new recipe, or, or the original recipe. I, I've actually never played around with the recipe of the stuff before. But here we are. Aluminum Oxide. And I need two of these in order to build the um, prime. So, next on our list, we clearly need a mobile bay. But secondly, what we need is... If I can get to the prime. Where is it at? That's a prime suit jet pack. I need one of those at some point. But still ingots. Yay. <laughs> I need two more aluminum oxide crystals, which fortunately I think I already have down here. If I remember, I think I had two extras. Man, I, I planned this perfectly. I had no intentions of accidentally having those on me. Um, and then plus steel ingots are just going to be lithium and um, I believe titanium ingots, which are made out of uh, 10 titanium a piece for anyone who doesn't already know that. Uh, but I had a lot of issue finding everything for the prawns, so that's why I'm kind of going through everything for you guys. Uh, let's see here. That's that. That's lithium. I hope I have more lithium on me somewhere. Otherwise, I may have to look for more lithium real quick. All right. So right over here, I think this is this is that's salt. Um, there is that it? Lithium. Good. Yeah, it looks a lot, lot weirder now, but um, I, I probably should heal this up. Boop. Didn't need to bump that. Okay, that was. I didn't drop it. I thought I dropped it. I believe that is everything I need now in order to build um, those. So, fabricator, come back up here. Build me two plus steel ingots, please. Okay, now next on my list of things I need is lubricant, which fortunately for me, I actually have lubricant with me. Is that everything I need for my device? Okay, aluminum oxide, which is easy enough. You can get that underneath of the, um, the floating island. Then plus steel ingot, which is 10 uh, titanium and 2 lithium. And then arrow gel, which we just found the ingredients for, which is the gel sack, the 2 gel sack, and 2 aluminum oxide. And the lubricant, which is, I believe, just 3... Um, clusters of seeds a piece so it is a very expensive build but it is very fortunate that uh, we have everything we need and now we shall build it and of course you do need the uh, mobile bay to build it but I'm gonna get up here make me a quick uh, thing and just prove that it is everything we need and good to go so I t I probably should bring my mobile bay with <laughs> So mobile bay is now out and running and roll. 
And I'm pretty sure I got uh, reclaimed water. Ooh. Purified reclaimed water. So, basically, I can pee now and get my water back. <laughs> I didn't know that. Okay, so prawn suit. Yes. I guess I thought I just killed the game. Commercial prophecy, uh, weeks of training. Okay, cool. Well, and since we have infinite power, that's awesome. Pick it up. And into the prawn suit we go, which is just floating. All right, well, if I get Welcome in this, it's probably gonna fall, right? Yep. All right, well, that is basically everything you need for that. Um, for anyone who was just looking for the tutorial, there you go, you're welcome. Everything you need, aerogel, you can actually get more aerogel if you hit, uh, hit it with a knife. I pointed that out in the episode. But now for anyone who is still staying around for the rest of it, we are going to go down and see if we can find that lost river. Because that has been a pain on the last episode, I couldn't seem to find it. But thanks to Iballistic Wolf in the comments, we should be able to find it. Um, she said that... Fudge! You know what? No, 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 I'm gonna go pick it up. She said that all I need to do is go over to that area that has the blood, um, blood kelp, I believe, and we'll just go down there and get it. So I'm gonna go down here, get me my, uh, prawn real quick. Honk, honk. You are the best captain on the planet. I'm not even squidding. What? <laughs> All right, down into the depths we go. Let's see if I can't figure out where that uh, area. Actually, I believe I found it right here. Let's see if I can actually fit down there, though. I think that's my biggest issue. I don't know if I can fit the Cyclops down there without actually crashing it. Let's see if I can skill do this. Do this skillfully. All right, down into this area we go. And I don't know if this is the correct area or not, but it is the right looking. So as of right now, we seem to be okay. No real issues with what's the front. Okay, this actually looks about right because this really dives deep real quick. Whoa. Fire! Oh! Um. That's apparently a thing. Or wall, better go down even further. I wonder if I'm ever going to be able to get back out of here. Because this is already getting to the point where... What is that? This is getting kind of weird. Oh, hey, I found an ink sack thing. There are apparently more down here. Although it's too deep for anyone to go without already having the prawn suit. Oh, whoa! Well, I got a whole bunch out of that one. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can just grab the fishy! Yeah, you did. <laughs> okay, I shall follow this uh, ominous looking green stuff. This way. Not entirely sure where it is or where it goes or anything like that, but you know what? It works for me. Oh boy. You know what? I think I may have just successfully found the Lost River first try. And was that a crab? That's totally a crab. Oh, I'm taking damage! <laughs> Rig for silent Hong Kong, buddy! Emergency speed. 
charge! Okay, I'm gonna get in the prawn suit. And maybe I can uh, go take care of this guy before he... <laughs> oh, this is just... This is funny. I killed you, crab squid. Huh. Oh, I killed him with the, uh, the, the, the cyclops. That's what happens if you get rammed or smashed or whatever it was I did. That looks extremely scary. What is that? Oh, please don't be alive. I think that's just the bones. Oh, this is a bone monster. Then I'm doomed. Holy cow, whatever that thing is. It is huge. How big is this skeleton? Eh, it looks about the same size as my ship. Yay. What is that noise? Prefer nothing that's trying to kill me. Just, just say, guys. Holy cow! This is really cool looking. Is that a brain on top of it? It's a flower with a brain. And this is like blue water. Whoa! That looks so cool. I wonder if this is like Manta Ray Homes or something like that. Because it, it seems like these guys are. Very insightful about this thing. So I'm gonna try to scan this thing. And hopefully not die. Well, wait, hold it. Is that clove tree? Giant clove tree. Or cove tree, I'm sorry. Not clove tree, cove tree. Whoa. Is this like a baby gonna hatch? 30 seconds. Ah, uh, 30 seconds. What is screaming like a baby? Oh, please don't hatch. That would scare me so much. If that's the egg, I don't want to see what comes out. Okay, so there's one infected down here, so maybe things are also very infected down here. I don't know how big this disease is or how far out it goes. All I know is that this uh, disease is infecting a lot of things and that's why this whole place is quarantined. We're going to go down here and see if there's anything deeper. How, how deep am I? I'm at 900 meters deep right now. Whoa! Well, hold up. Holy cow, that's deep. I thought I had found the deepest part already. Holy cow. I am now at a point where I can no longer get out um, without my prawn, which is why I brought him with. Welcome aboard, Captain. What are you? What are you? There's a big jelly thingy in my face. Um, did that get rid of him or not? Ah, well, it seems to have got rid of him. I don't know what the thing is. But this is deep. What is that? Ugh, it's so disgusting looking. So this is the point where there is actually lava. I was told to go into the uh, Lost River though, so I think... If I remember correctly, I think I need to go this way. Back up and in. Even though this is also pretty deep. I don't know. I, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to decide, should I go this way, or should I go this way, or should I go back? 
Um, I don't actually know where the research station is, but I feel like if that's there... And which way am I looking? I'm looking northwest right now. Southwest is... This way. And I got a fishy thing on me. You know what? Can I scan that? Lava larva. What, what is that? Grub species which appears to lack sense of sight and smell, but is able to sense and drain thermal energy in the environment. Oh no. They're gonna drain my battery. All right, well. I'm gonna get rid of this guy. And then I would like some uh, help from you guys. If you guys wouldn't mind helping me figure out which direction I need to go to get to the research station, that would be awesome. Because I don't know if I should go back up to the blue waterfalls, uh, down to the left, which is, uh, let me see if I can just do this, this is way easier. Down to the left, which is this way, um, like down here, or down to that direction, which is to the right, which looks a lot more ominous and probably more scary. But I'm trying to figure out where the, uh, research station might be, and I'm pretty sure, if I'm correct, it should be to the southwest of the location of the other one, so that's why I was tempted to go to the blue area. But you guys can uh, help me decide that down below in the comments. Um, but make sure to leave a double thumbs up to first, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.